What's up, Dope Chaser? My name is Jason White, CEO and founder of Witness Riches. Today, we are talking about the $2.2 trillion stimulus check program that was just approved a few days ago. And I know some of you are thinking, Jason, when I get my $1,200, maybe $2,400 check, what should I do first? And I have three particular things I'm gonna share with you in which you should be thinking about during the next two to four weeks so that you use your check wisely. So let's dive into it. The first thing that you should think of when you get your check is, am I taking care of all of my bare necessities? You have four particular bare necessities that you need to be focused on during the next month so that you and your family are secure, comfortable, and thriving. You need to think about, is the rent paid? Do we have enough groceries to last for another month? Are the lights and gas behind? A lot of people aren't paying their lights and gas because they're expecting these companies just to take care of them. Take care of yourself. So the four things that you wanna focus on first is catch up on the rent, get groceries in the house, pay the lights and gas. You do that, you can move on to the next stage. The second thing that you should be focused on when you get your stimulus check is, do I have enough money set aside God forbid I can't go to work this month. A lot of you were unprepared, let's be honest. You did not have any money set aside for a rainy day. Emergencies hit and you were shit out of luck. I don't want you to go through that again. What you need to focus on is you need to make sure you put money to the side that's there for an emergency. God forbid if anything were to happen, you can depend on yourself and you won't be Shout out the luck. So you're gonna get that $1,200 check. You may get 2,400. You may get more than that if you got a house full of kids. The situation is you wanna make sure that you can depend on yourself. Just about 80% of Americans live paycheck to paycheck. Most Americans cannot afford to take care of a $400 emergency. The state that we're living in is very sad and we need to do better with our finances to make sure that we can at least take care of ourselves during an emergency. So what you need to do is you need to establish at least a $2,000 emergency fund. If you're getting a stimulus check from the government and you've taken care of your bare necessities, put that money to the side and focus on building your emergency fund. That is what I recommend for you to do. The third thing that you can do with your stimulus check is you can be strategic. So if you have student loans, one thing the government is doing is they're going to stop student loan payments until September. I recommend that you do more research on that, but to the best of my knowledge, payments for U.S. Department of Education loans will be delayed until September. That means you have April, May, June, July, August, almost five to six payments that you don't have to pay. What's going on with those student loans is there's gonna be 0% interest on those student loans, okay? So if you don't have an emergency fund, you have a couple months of payments that you can put towards your emergency fund. But if you have an emergency fund set for yourself, you can get strategic. 0% interest means that all payments moving forward on that loan are going straight to the principal. This is a great way for you to pay down your student loans if you have the available funds. And if you are someone who's taking care of your bare necessities, you have an emergency fund, and you're still getting income into the household, this is the opportunity for you to pay down your student loans tremendously. 0% interest means all payments moving forward are going towards the principal until they add interest back to the loan. So I, I highly recommend that you do more research so that you can have all the facts regarding the student loan situation, but this is a great strategy for you to take advantage of if you have the means to do so. So those are the three things that I want you to focus on when you get your stimulus check from the government. Be strategic, use that money wisely, and make sure you put your family first. Hey, and to help you get more strategic with your finances, I created what is called the Black Lettuce Budget Planner. Take a look at that. It's a beautiful thing. And in this budget planner, it's going to allow you to strategically use your finances and track things like putting together a monthly budget, creating smart goals for yourself, tracking your daily expenses, snowballing your debt, and also paying off your debt. And much, much more is included in the Black Letters Budget Planner. If you are someone who is serious about getting out of debt and taking your finances to the next level, I highly suggest you get our Black Letters Budget Planner. Go to blackletters.com to order yours today.
Again, my name is Jason White. I want to thank you for your time. Please do me a favor, like this video, share with your friends and family who could benefit from this information, and make sure you follow and subscribe to our channel. That way we can continue to keep in touch and I can continue to share information that's going to help you transcend financially. I'm out, y'all. Peace.